All right, guys, so we just talked about the pressure control position. Now let's talk about how we can look to advance our position by going to what's called the neon belly position, okay? So I'll show you what it looks like here briefly, and I'll give it a breakdown here. So we're in pressure control, rips. All right, so it's a very small movement. I'm not really doing much here in terms of steps, uh, but there are a few details here that we have to be aware of. All right, so we're obviously starting in pressure control. I'm not gonna go into the details of that because you've already seen that in a previous video. But we're starting off in pressure control here and usually I have like my hand in the collar, I'm pinching his hips on the other side. What I'm gonna look to do when I go to neon belly is I'm gonna keep this grip on his lapel, but this hand's gonna kinda sneak up and I can look to just get a grip on whatever I can. Sometimes it's easiest to grab the belt, sometimes uh, the, the material, the pants right at the hip here, okay? Because what I'm looking to do is once I get these grips, right, I'm gonna be punching down into the mat as I pop up to neon belly. But before I do that, what's very important is just like when we hold pressure control, I want to back his legs and his knees in the opposite direction here, okay? So I'm going to drive off this leg and start backing his legs the other way. And now as I pop up, look how I fan my knee. I start with my kneecap basically pointed towards his head, and then I fan it all the way out so it's basically perpendicular across his chest here. Once I get here, I can let go of my grips and put my hands right on his shoulders to keep him flat, okay? Now notice too how I don't have this knee on the ground. I have this knee up off of the mat, ensuring that I'm putting a lot of pressure into my partner, okay? Also notice how when I hold knee on belly correctly, my foot should never be on the ground here. A lot of the times people will put the foot on the ground just to like, because they're afraid the partner's gonna be hurt, okay? Just know that when we hold the knee on belly position, it's more like a shin on belly. Because when I'm here, I wanna make sure that I slide my whole shin across his belly so my foot is no longer on the mat, my knee is up off the ground with a little bit of bend because I don't want it too far away or too close because if he moves around, I gotta be ready to follow him here, okay? And make small adjustments. So. The biggest thing, guys, is make sure we back the legs up just like in pressure control before we pop up. If I just have my grips and I just pop up, look, he's going to sneak his knee in here immediately and he's going to start recomposing and I got to exhaust myself of passing the guard once again. Okay? But once I have my grips and I back the knees away from me, as I pop up, he's not in position to get his guard back. and I can get to neon belly, okay? So one more time all the way through. Pressure control, get your grips, back the legs up, and I pop up, fanning my knee up from his head all the way across his belly here. Put our hands on the shoulders for the most basic way to hold that position, okay? So that is pressure control to neon belly.